Hi, I'm Quijada Morvissing. I'm a civic health researcher and I hail from the state of Maine, but I work nationally on civic engagement issues. I run my own business called Public Engagement Partners, and I'm here today to help the group really understand what civic health is. Um, I started exploring civic health around 2012, and the way I would define civic health is that it's really um, overall measures of civic life in a community. So that includes how much people vote, how much they volunteer, uh, doing favors for neighbors, but also feelings like how much people feel like they trust government, trust each other, belong and matter to their communities. So part of what I'm going to present about today is how to measure this thing called civic health. How do we know if our communities are healthy civically or if they're struggling? Oftentimes uh, I think of civic health as uh, kind of like a doctor's checkup where we need to take the pulse of the community every so often to try to see you know, where we're strong and, and where we're deficient so we can create some interventions. Uh, these interventions I call civic actions, and we're gonna be talking today about how some civic health data can be um, used to catalyze civic action um, in communities across the state. Um, really excited to see this work lift off in Florida, such an important place to, to examine civic health. Um, and I'm looking forward to speaking with you today.